Hi friends, welcome to Learn with Krishna Sandeep channel. In this video, we'll see one important program. Okay, it's a Java coding interview question. So, how to filter, how to filter even and odd numbers. Okay, so before Java, everyone knows that how to filter even and odd numbers. Okay, uh, there is already video on that. So, but in Java, if you have to filter right, how do we do that? If you have to filter even and odd numbers. So, in this video, we are going to learn about one important method in Java 8, which is filter method. What is the method name? Filter method. And the filter method, as its name suggests, it filters the elements based upon the condition we give. Okay, what does filter method do? It will filter elements based on the condition we give it. For example, if a list contain numbers and we want only numbers that are divisible by 2, we can use filter numbers. We have a list of both even numbers and odd numbers. If we want to filter only even numbers, then we can use filter to get uh, to filter the even numbers. So the filter method essentially selects elements based on the condition we provide. So based on the condition we provide, we'll be using this filter method. So uh, filter, uh, what it does is it accepts a predicate object which provides a function that is applied to a condition. Okay. So we'll look into this detail filter method in the in next few minutes. Uh, but for the time being, so what I'll do is I'll just start writing the code how to filter even numbers and odd numbers. So I'm just taking the integer. Okay, integer list equal to arrays dot as list of 1 comma 3 comma 4 comma 2 comma 8 okay and uh, 13 and just so first what we are doing here I am just creating an integer list and in this integer list we need to filter both even numbers and odd numbers so list integer odd equal to list dot stream so on list we need to call stream so this filter method is present inside which one stream okay and just call filter as I told you what filter will do it will accept okay a predicate so so here I am just giving the condition saying lambda n percentile 2 not equal to 0. So if the n percentile 2 is not equal to 0, then we say it is an what? It's an odd number. So here I am calling n, n lambda, n percentile 2. n is nothing but here what? So after this filter method, what we need to do, whatever the values we get from here, we need to collect. Okay. So just call collect as dot to list. Okay. So list dot stream dot filter. And here what we are doing, we are giving the condition to filter odd numbers. If a number is not divisible by two, we call it as an odd number. So n lambda n percentile to not equal to zero and what are the values what are the values we get we need to uh, collect so here we'll be using the collectors dot to list method to collect the values so finally what are the values we get we'll be storing it in the odd list and similarly if you want to filter even numbers right what we'll do we'll just call list dot stream okay so it returns what the stream will do it returns a sequential stream with the collection dot filter n percentile 2 equal to equal to 0 and finally just call collect method and collectors dot to list so this is how we filter both even numbers and odd numbers. So just say system dot okay out dot println 
even list equal to even list even list equal to even and system dot out dot mental and odd list equal to odd odd okay let's run the program and see the output if you see here two four eight are exactly divisible by two hence these are the even numbers and uh, these 1, 3 and 13 are not divisible by 2 and hence these are odd numbers. So let's see uh, more details about this filter method. So what this uh, filter will do? Okay. Uh, if the condi, it will filter the values based on the condition we provide. Okay. This filter will accept what? It accepts a predicate. Okay. What it accepts? Filter will accept a predicate. And this filter is a method in which one? Stream. Okay. So filter method is a lazy one. Okay. It's a filter is a lazy. This is an intermediate operation. And at the same time, what it returns, it returns a stream and it's a lazy, meaning it will be evaluated. Okay. Only will we call collect method on this. What do you mean by uh, lazy? So this value uh, this condition will be evaluated only when we call collect on it. If you are not calling collect on this, it will not uh, evaluate this condition and it will not uh, filter those values. Got it? So this is how we uh, filter the even and odd numbers using Java. So thanks for watching my video. If you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel.